If you're looking for a bite to eat, you might find a bit of history along with it at a unique eats in Springville. Yeah, it is called Legacy, and you're about to see why the name fits. Daybreak Stephanie Barnes shows us how they're serving up a tribute to the community. restaurant can boast about the quality recipes that fill the menu, but not every restaurant can say they've got the names of quality local legends lining their menu too. You notice on our menu we have some dishes that are named after certain elements of our community, certain people that have, in my estimation, made a difference. Welcome to The Legacy, where you can get a sandwich and a Springville history lesson all in one. The Main Street Eatery is officially reopened. Owners Kathy and Ted ran the spot successfully for six years, but closed in 2006 when it became too much to balance with their full-time local insurance business. For Ted, though, the idea kept simmering. I kind of understood that I had a, an unfulfilled mission. A mission to maintain this landmark building in the heart of Springville and to use it to somehow better the community. It still has the flavor of the original legacy they ran in the early 2000s, but with some tweaks. The downstairs features casual dining with a bar and high top tables. Upstairs, dining at a higher level. In this second time around, don't think of us just in terms of a place for some kind of a, a really good dinner on a Thursday, Friday or Saturday night. Think about us all the time. Think about the legacy in more ways than one, which brings us back to the menu. Mixed into your choice of a burger, pasta, or a filet, you'll find the names of people who have left legacies. Take the Zelinsky Brothers Triple Play, a sandwich named after local baseball boosters, or the Garlux Deluxe Scacciata, named for a businessman and family friend. Why is that name in your menu? Well, guess what? They may learn about someone who was really important Microphone check in creating um, not only business, but a relationship with people in a town that um, is all about that. Kathy and Ted know they won't be able to run this place forever, but their goal is to get something sustainable going here so that even when it is time, again, to move on from running this restaurant, the legacy of town influencers will live on, and the legacy of Kathy and Ted will no doubt live on too. Such a unique spot in general and for Springville, something the owners say they you really can't find anywhere else in the village. The Legacy serves up lunch, uh, their lunch menu Mondays through Saturdays, and they add their din dinner menu, menu Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. And that co-owner, Ted, that you met there, he is a musician. He sings. And so the next step for them is to start bringing live music in. You heard jazz through the whole thing. He loves Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin. So they're, they're going to be getting some live music in there, too. So so many cool things going good on. Good music, good food, good yes. backstory. Yes. Mm -hmm. Awesome stuff. Yeah. Good Thank deal. You. Thanks very much, Steph. Yep. It is